Hello my handsome and sexy dooley bastards, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to battle these three fragrances, oh yeah. The reason why I am battling these is because each one of these has won a lot of battles in the battle videos that I did. So first is the most popular Dior Sauvage, the sexy Dolce & Gabbana the one, and Versace Eros Eau de Parfum. And guys, this battle video is amazing because I got only beautiful women in this video. This battle video I have shot at a Kayali event. It was the launch of Yum Pistachio Gelato. Oof. And this one, guys, this one is amazing. This one is really good. In this video, I'm also reacting to this fragrance blind. So you will see my first reactions on this one as well. All right, guys, I'm not gonna make this intro any longer. I know you guys are here for the battle. So grab yourselves a cup of coffee and put your balls in a good position. And let's get into it. Look who I found! Look at her! Hi so guys. sexy! Number one. Don't pick which one it is. Do you like it for men? Yes or no? Yes. 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 No picky. No. Okay. Second one? No. No? Deal so much. Yeah. <laughs> now we got the professional. <laughs> or the last one. I think I have to go with the last one because it has like the touch of sweetness that I really like. Okay. The last one I think is the best. Last one is the best. Okay. It is a uh, Versace Eros. Nice. I love Versace Eros. Okay, and the first one, can I smell again? What is the first one? Dolce & Gabbana the one. Ah, it's very nice, but I prefer the, the, last, the last one. one. Yeah. How good is it if guys wear it? I, I love when a guy wears Versace Eros because it's fresh, but it still has that sweet like bubblegum sexiness. Yeah. So I personally, I love it. Still to this day, I recommend this one. Good. It's really good. Okay guys, we yeah. have heard it from the professional Versace Eros. <laughs> Which one is this or <laughs> Which one is so, the Eros? Versace Eros. Eros. <laughs> An honest opinion, okay? okay? Okay. Do you like this for men? Yes or no? Yes. Yes? Yes. Is it sexy for men or just not? It's normal? light, very it's light. light. Yes. Yeah. Okay. We need the best, okay? <laughs> Is this one better or...? Better, yeah. Better. Yes. Or the last one? Which one is the best? The second one. The second one. Because usually I like strong. For men, usually strong. You like powerful men. Yeah, oh. rude, something like this. Okay. So this is most um, yeah, similar. The, strongest. the second one. Okay, you like Dior Sauvage. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So that was the one that you picked. Ah, nice. Yeah. nice. Thank you so much. Thank you. So say which one okay. you like on a man. Okay. okay. It's a bell. I'm ready. Okay. Here you go. Okay. 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 Is it nice? Yeah. Okay. For men? It's definitely a scent I've smelled before. Okay. This is like stronger. Yeah, it is. Okay. And or the last one. Don't peek. Which one it is? No, don't peek. Okay, this one I don't like. I feel like every guy smells like this. Okay. okay. Let me put this one away. It's between those two. Um, and also celebrating this new chapter of focusing on this my one. dating That one? Yeah. Wow. What is this one? Thank Sauvage. Oh, you are oh, oh, basic. <laughs> you're the basic one. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. They're all basic. It's uh, Dolce & Gabbana the one. Yeah. Dior Sauvage. Okay. And Versace Eros. Oh, yeah. okay. Which but, one did I not like? Arrows. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. What do you think this for a man? Okay, this one smells fresh. Yes. Yeah. Do you like that or not? <laughs> I do, but I want to try the two other ones. Okay. What do you think about this? Ooh. This makes me want to hug the guy. <laughs> okay. 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 Huggable. That, Huggable. That, yes. Let's see. And this one. Hmm. This one makes me imagine of someone wearing suits and a businessman, like you know, a CEO. Like, okay. oh my God, Fifty Shades of Grey. What's his name? What is his name? Christian Grey. Yes, oh. Christian Grey. Honey, what are you thinking about with this one? Oh shit. Yes, Fifty Shades. Hello. Fifty Shades. That's yes, what we want. Christian Grey. I would definitely go for that one. Wow. <laughs> 
<laughs> but okay. I'm married, by the way. <laughs> uh, give it to your husband. Dude, You're like husband, right? Yes. But you have to tell me what that is. It's Versace Eros. What? <laughs> Okay, I would never it imagine it's from a Versace brand no, because I'm saying it's eau de parfum. Mm. So it's a higher concentration than okay. the normal one. Okay. Yeah, that's the one But never like. would I imagine it's from Versace. A Versace because makes you think of stuff. Because sometimes I feel like for scent like this, I yeah. sometimes think it's either Armani or Givenchy. Mm -hmm. Versace. But Eros. I like it. Nice. Yeah. Yes, it's definitely. Good. Okay, and the one that you also like was Sauvage. Uh, Dior? Yeah. Okay. Uh-huh. Huggable. Yeah. Huggable. Yeah, that was the Huggable, Huggable guy. And this yeah. was like, you're not really a reaction, but that was Dolce & Gabbana, the one. It was okay. Ah, the one. Yeah. Classic. Classic. They're all turning into classics right now. They're old. Yeah. But they're good. Okay, Eros, really guys, like if it. you want to be Christian Grey for a night, then, uh, <laughs> then Eros. <laughs> I would go for Eros. If you want something that's uh, gentleman, distinct, luxury, I think yeah. the third yeah. set is nice. Yeah. yeah. Okay, thank you, lady. You're welcome. <laughs> Do you like it if a man wears this, yes or no? If the woman wears this? Men. Men? Yeah. Would you like it on a man or no? Yeah. Yeah? On the summer. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, it's very, it's very light. Let's see. Mm, I like it. Oh, it's really light, so light quite sweet. For, yeah, yeah. For, for the hot weather, yeah. it sounds good. Yeah, I like that for summer, like yeah. you yeah. said. Wow. Okay. That was a good reaction. Let's see about this one. It's more like giving me autumn. Autumn? Okay. But I mean, like, it's basic. Yeah. Like, I, I, can, I, can, okay. I, can, I can feel it everywhere. Like, I, it's, it's like, you know, like you can smell the smell yeah. in every preferences. I, I don't know. I feel like. Can. No, because it's it's very like bland to me. Bland. It's like I, yeah, yeah. It's, it's like boring. It's I'm boring. boring. That's I'm the sorry. word. I'm just I'm just I'm just giving. Be you honest. We want your honesty. Okay. okay. So I'm this one like is boring. boring. Yeah, just boring. I wouldn't remember it. Yeah. Yeah. And we want these girls to remember you. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Last one. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh, is this a winner? Yeah. Yeah. What? Why so many cents in one? It's a mix a little bit, yeah. Strong. It gives you sweet, then light, wow. then strong. Like it's like three Yeah, one. it's like this different kind of like yeah, scent yeah, yeah, and yeah. it just changes. So yes, I would like, think about like, this like person a, yeah. all day. It's like an aftertaste, you know, when you eat something yes. and then there's aftertaste. I would think about this person all the time. after I leave, yeah. That's what we want. Yeah. Oh, this one. Is. This one? Both? Yeah, this, one? this yeah, one. The, the, How good is it from one to ten? How sexy say, like, is it? Nine. Nine. Eight. Eight. Seven. Yeah. Versace Eros. Oh, I'm gonna buy this for my husband. This Eros. And the other one that you like was the first one was Dolce & Gabbana, the one. Oh, oh that's okay, why. Okay, that's why. Yeah. Yeah. And okay, which okay. one didn't we like? Uh, Sauvage. Sauvage. I knew oh. it. I knew it. I'm like, Everyone has Sauvage? it. Yeah. yeah, that's why it was boring because yeah. I can hear... Don't I can buy this one. No, I mean, you can. But you like, can, but everyone, everyone has it. Everyone has it, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. so you're now... Versace is the winner. Yeah. Versace! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, thank you girls, thank, thank you so much. much. First one. Do you like it for a man, yes or no? It's sexy, I like it's it. It's sexy, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, now you. I love men's fragrance. Me it's too, so me too. Oh, it's fresh. I like, I like it. It's it. fresh, a little bit spicy, it's all yeah. mixed. Very nice. It's already mixed. I'm gonna tell you good. later. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we want that, we want that you feel good. Okay, next one. It's okay. This one is okay? Mm. Mm. Uh, 50 plus. 50 plus. <laughs> so for an old man. Okay. <laughs> or the last one. Remember which one you liked? The first one. The first one? Oh, this is tricky. Tricky, yeah? And have your own opinion, doesn't matter what she likes, I want your opinion. If you like the first one, it's okay. If you like this one, it's okay. There's something here I like more. You like that one more? Yeah. Okay. If a man wears this, how good is it from 1 to 10? Like, how sexy? 9. 9? 9. Oh my god, it's a rifle. 1 to 9. No problem, 9. Okay. okay. And the one that you like, yeah. how sexy is it if a man wears it? It's on the other side. 
eight, nine out of ten. <laughs> nine out of ten. That's good. You like Dolce and Gabbana, the one. You oh, like nice. Versace. I love Dolce, by the way. Oh, yeah, that was Versace. Oh, okay. Yeah, you like, like it? And almost the, the middle one. Sauvage. Nice. Wow, how come? Love I it. don't know. You just like the sweeter ones better. Do you like this for men? Yes or no? For men? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Is it sexy? It's nice. It's nice. Mm. Fresh. Can I nice and like fresh. Fahad? Yeah, it smells like Hanna too. Oh. <laughs> or actually, I don't know that one. Uh, it smells like Fahad. It smells like Fahad. Why do I know his smell? Yellow. Oh. <laughs> so it smells like someone, second one. Is it better than the first one or not? Uh, it has a little bit more uh, wood. I prefer the first I prefer one. The, first. the first one? I prefer one? the first one. Okay. Or the last one. Which one is the best? This is the strongest, I feel. It has like a uh, It has like this type of uh, seed. I, like I the prefer first. the first the one. The first one? Okay, both of you like Dolce & Gabbana the one for men the most. How sexy is it from 1 to 10? If a man wears it, is it like 6 well, or is it, it depends like on the man? Well, it's 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. <laughs> 10 my <laughs> husband is not like him. Then it's 10 out of 10. Yeah. Okay, for you? 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, sexy. Thank you, thank you ladies. Do you like this for men? Yes or no? Yeah, it's nice. Okay. This one. Mm, not my favorite one. Not your favorite. Or the last one. Oh, I like this one actually. This one? Oh, nice, yeah. Is this one the best or the first? Uh, I would say the last one. The last one? Yeah. If a man wears this, how good is it from 1 to 10? Oh, I would say 9. 9? Yeah. I really? like Versace Eros. It's a classic one, so I it's think. It's classic, yeah. so it's good. Now, this one. Is it good if a man wears that, yes or no? Oh my god, it's so yummy. It's even a unisex fragrance. But however, if I have this on a man, I would definitely. You want to you want to take a piece out of it? Definitely, Ooh. yeah. <laughs> then I know where I need to spray this one. Ooh, <laughs> let's try it. Let's see. Tell me, what do you think about it? It's really good. Yeah, it's nice. also for right. men. Of course. Yeah. I smell rum. Yes. It's yummy, addictive, really juicy. You yeah. have a lot of vanilla, pistachio. It's really. But it also has some freshness. Definitely. Wow. No, definitely a unisex. If I would rate this for a man on a date, eight and a half. Yeah. Eight Can I smell it on you? Yeah. Amazing. Wow. It's really good. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. It's welcome. Do you like this for a man? Yes or no? Yes. I yeah. like it. It's quite fresh, quite aromatic. But it has a kind of a metallic effect. Mm -hmm. If I, I can compare with the two other ones. Yeah? Yeah, you can. Just a second. Don't watch which one it is. I, I wrote on it. Hi. How are you? How are you? I prefer the second one. The second one? Okay, this is the last one. This is my favorite. I like it a lot. Now professionals are smelling it instead of random people on the street. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm taking yeah. time. Take your time. I'll take the last one. The last one? Why? I think it's a bit more elegant. I like this uh, dry woods. Inside. Okay. The second one is more commercial to me. I like it, but it's more arom it's more like a fougère commercial. Yes, it is. And the first one I like it as well, but okay. But if you have to choose, it's going to be the Eros. Okay. Um, you like Versace Eros? Which one? Versace Eros. Yeah. Yeah. yeah That's actually. the one that you like. And the first one was the one. Yes. Second one, the commercial one is Sauvage. Sauvage. Yeah. yeah. I recognize the Sauvage. Yeah. Exactly. Thank you. Do you like this for men? Yes or no? And be honest. It's very light. Yes, I do. You do? That's good. Okay, second one. I like this one more. You like it more? Yeah, I like overwhelming smells. That's, no? that's that. Yeah. yeah, I prefer this one actually. Okay. Or the last one. This one. Oh, this is my favorite. Okay. We have a favorite. That's the favorite. Yeah, can I keep this? <laughs> you can keep the man who has it on him. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, so I love that. Good. If I want my future husband to wear this fragrance. Future husbands in there. 
wear it. Wear it for her. You're gonna share with me the name, right? Yes. But first I need to know how good is it from 1 to 10. It's 12. It's 12. That's what we want. So it's good. <laughs> it's good. This is the best one. It's Versace Eros. Oh, yeah. Versace. So that's really good. And we got a famous YouTuber here as well. Tell us who you are. So I'm Rowan Dash. Rowan Dash. Yes, I make videos on YouTube. Uh, it's my passion. I make food videos, uh, entertainment, makeup. Okay, good. So if you want to see that, follow her. And I her subscribe to her. Exactly. <laughs> I Thank love you. perfumes. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh. This is beautiful. Yeah. A lot of votes for this one. It is really between Eros and Dolce Gabbana, the one. Oh, but I'm, I'm like... I love what you're doing, so are you like just asking people for their opinions? Honest on opinions. We I need to know that. which one is the best for the ladies. That's really nice. Now, I help the men smell the best. Which one is your favorite? My favorite. Out of the three? The one. Dolce & Gabbana, the one. Oh, the... the, the, the yeah, that would be my favorite. It's nice, but it's like very it's light. It's too soft. Yeah. yeah. But if for going out, yeah. that you're going to smell it in uh, in the air, then it's going to be Eros. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, I am between those two. Yeah. And the other one that you also like was um, Sauvage. Oh yeah, of course. That was the potent one. Oh yeah, of course. Yeah. This is like a classic. It's a classic. It's yeah. good. Everyone has it, but still good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> yes, and the winner is Eros with 8 points. This one won massively over the other two. And honestly, between these three fragrances, I would also recommend you to buy Versace Eros Eau de Parfum. Get the Eau de Parfum version. That one is better than the Eau de Toilette. It is fresh and sweet at the same time. And that is what girls go crazy for, as you've seen in the video. This is a big, big compliment puller. Longevity is amazing with this one. It's also a very big in projection. This one will get the most compliments out of all the three. And this one just smells the best. I always tell you guys that this is a magnet to the noses of the ladies. Eros does that. Girls find this one sexy. One girl said it was, it reminded her of Christian Grey. Now, and we know what Christian Grey does. This stuff is just very sexy to us. Also to me. I also fall for this one. This got a rating between eight, nine, every time a high rating. So guys, if you don't have Eros yet in your collection, what are you doing? Get it, girls love it. Yes, and at second place with three votes, girls also really like this one. Isn't the winner, but it's still good. They said it was sexy, light and fresh, and it is that. And it's not only fresh, this one is also sweet, Warm, spicy, tobacco note in there. This one is really something special. The only downside of this one is that it is light and it doesn't really perform and it doesn't really push us off of your skin. That's always the reason why I recommend this one for date nights because this one stays close to the skin. If you want to go out and you want to get a lot of attention with this one, then trust me, you have to go above 20 sprays with this one. Else is not going to give you compliments. People will not notice you if you spray below five sprays. Trust me. But girls will find that this is a sexy fragrance and that is the reason why you need to check this out but wear it on date nights. Oh, longevity and projection is shit. That's why I suggest you to go above 20 sprays. If you would spray this one normal, longevity is around four hours and projection um, 30 minutes. Yeah, so uh, spray a lot. Yes, and the last one, Sauvage, with only two points. Still, look, it's a good one. But as the girl said, like, everybody has this fragrance. And that is the downside of this one. It smells like everybody. And you want to be different. Now, a woman said that she likes strong. This is a strong fragrance. It is that. It will get you noticed. It will get you compliments. But you're not unique. So it is a bit boring. But where does one while working out or going to your job or anything like that, then this one is pleasant. But if you want to impress ladies, then don't go for this one. Go for Eros. Now longevity is really good with this one. It is eight to 10 hours. Now it doesn't perform as good as what it once did, but still it is good. And projection is very far because of the umbroxen that's in here. So you will still get noticed, but longevity is around eight to 10 hours, which is still very good. But I wouldn't recommend you guys to get this one. Not really.
All right, and for the guys who are interested in Yum Pistachio Gelato, bro, this one is amazing. Look how much I've worn this one already. I really love this stuff. I don't have this one for a long time, but I'm already here. I think I've, what is it, 10 milliliters? Yeah, I think I've emptied already 10 milliliters. This one is really lovely. And although the first hour it leans feminine, after the first hour it goes more into the unisex kind of a direction. Oh, it's really good. Mm. I have smelled this one on, uh, on Pierre, the boyfriend of uh, Demi Rowling. Amazing on him. On him, it smells masculine, actually. So don't overlook fragrances from Kajali. Don't think like, oh my God, they're only making feminine fragrances. I can't wear them. There is no such thing as a feminine or a masculine smell. Not really. Here in Dubai, they don't even market it towards that. They don't say it is feminine or masculine. It's just a fragrance and you can wear whatever you want. It's just in the West that everything is masculine and feminine. So don't shy away from these fragrances. You have to try it out or you are going to like it yourself or you like it for your girlfriend or you're going to use it, both of you. I really love this one, but this one is my second favorite from her line. My favorite is the gold bottle. It's called Vanilla Royale. Oh my God, that one is amazing. So for the guys, if I would suggest you to check out fragrances from Kajali, it will be this one and Vanilla Royale. Check it out. All right, guys, and this was the fragrance video of today. Hope you enjoyed it. Get Versace Eros and check out Kajali fragrances and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.